Hey guys, welcome back to SQ06 programming. In the previous video, we saw a program to check whether a number is prime or not. And in this video, we will see a program to generate prime numbers up to 100. So let's see the code. Uh, see out prime numbers up to 100. So here is the for loop int n is equal to 2 n is more than equal to 100 n plus plus so we will simultaneously take all the numbers till 100 and check each number whether it is prime or not so in the this uh, in the first for loop int count is equal to 0 uh, we will take a variable count and, and initialize it to 0 uh, for int i is equal to 2 i is more than equal to n i plus plus so here's the for loop in this for loop we will check whether that number is prime or not so let's assume that the first number is 2 okay int n is equal to 2 now you will check whether 2 is prime or not int count is equal to 0 for int i is equal to 2 so now i is 2 if n modulo i is equal to 0 wait i is smaller than n 2 is smaller than 2 is a false statement then we don't need to go into the for loop they will come out of the for loop now int count is equal to 0 so count is equal to 0 yes and we will display n okay so 2 is prime so 2 is being displayed now again we will go back to for loop first for loop and we will check if 3 is prime or not now int count is equal to 0 i is 2 uh, 2 is smaller than 3 yes we will go into the for loop if n modulo i is equal to 0 so 3 modulo 2 is equal to 0 no so if statement is not going to be executed now count remains 0 now again we will go back to this second for loop and this time i is 3 now 3 is smaller than 3 is a false statement we will come out of the for loop now count is 0 yes it is 0 c out n so 3 is being displayed at it as it is a prime number now we will go back to the first for loop now this time we will check whether 4 is prime or not now int count is equal to 0 int i is equal to 2 i is 2 2 is smaller than 4 yes we will go into this for loop if n modulo i is equal to 0 4 modulo is equal to 0 yes it is 0 so we will go into the if statement and increment this count variable count plus plus that is count is equal to 1 now and we'll again go back to for loop now i is 3 uh, 3 is smaller than 4 yes we will go into this for loop now if 4 modulo 3 is equal to 0 no it's not 0 so count remains 1 and now i is 4 and here we end the for loop and come out so if count is equal to 0 see out n no count is 1 that is the number 4 is not prime so we will not display 4 now similarly we will check for other numbers uh, now n is 5 and similarly we will go on and check whether it is prime or not if it is prime then we will display it and if it's not prime then we don't have to display it now let's see whether the code is perfectly fine or not prime numbers up to 100 2 3 5 7 11 yes yes so on yes it's all prime numbers up to 100 these are 25 prime numbers up to 100 so the code is working now you can copy this code here and try it out yourself if you like the video then subscribe to our channel sk06 thank you and goodbye